Welcome back to the Biotechnology Lecture Series. This is the third lecture on the introduction of biotechnology. In this lecture, we will cover safety in biotechnology, number two, public perception of biotechnology, number three, biotechnology and ethics, and lastly, biotechnology and the developing world. First and foremost, let's talk about safety. Biotechnology, a multidisciplinary field encompassing biology, chemistry, genetics, and engineering, plays a pivotal role in advancing science and technology. Ensuring safety in biotechnology is of paramount importance. Researchers and organizations must adhere to rigorous safety protocols to prevent accidents, environmental harm, and health risks. This involves robust containment procedures, risk assessments, and adherence to ethical guidelines to mitigate any potential harm. Public perception of biotechnology is a dynamic and complex matter. While many people embrace biotech innovations for their potential to improve healthcare, agriculture, and industry, others express concerns. Issues such as genetically modified organisms, GMOs, gene editing, and cloning often raise ethical and environmental questions. To address these concerns, it is crucial for the biotech community to engage in transparent communication and education, fostering a better understanding of the benefits and risks associated with biotechnology. Now, let's delve into the ethical dimension. Biotechnology and ethics are intrinsically linked. The power to manipulate living organisms, alter genetic codes, or engineer new life forms raises profound ethical dilemmas. Bioethics, a field dedicated to exploring these questions, helps establish guidelines and principles for responsible biotech research and applications. Key ethical concerns include informed consent in human gene editing, equitable access to biotech advancements, and the preservation of biodiversity while using genetic modification in agriculture. Striking a balance between scientific progress and ethical considerations remains a central challenge. Lastly, biotechnology has the potential to address numerous challenges facing the developing world, ranging from food security and disease control to clean energy production. However, it also raises concerns about equity and access. Developing nations often lack the resources, infrastructure, and regulatory frameworks to harness the benefits of biotechnology fully. Collaborative efforts between developed and developing nations, as well as partnerships between public and private sectors, are crucial to ensure that biotech solutions reach those who need them most. Moreover, ethical considerations must guide these efforts to avoid exploitation and promote sustainable development. In conclusion, biotechnology is a double-edged sword that offers immense promise, but also presents significant challenges. Ensuring safety, managing public perception, adhering to ethical principles, and addressing the needs of the developing world are all essential components of responsible biotech advancement. Striking a balance between scientific innovation and ethical integrity will be the key to harnessing the full potential of biotechnology for the betterment of humanity. That's all for today. See you in the next video for lecture number four.